All right, we start in George where a rescue operation is underway in the Western Cape to find over 40 workers trapped after a building collapsed. Several people have been rescued, but exact numbers are not yet known. The collapse has resulted in the closure of Victoria Street and the municipality's offices, which are adjacent to York Street. Authorities there have been asking members of the public for help. They've established drop-off points for those wishing to donate drinking water, energy drinks, wine gums, or any food for the team working on site. George Mayer, Leon van Weyck, says he can't confirm if there are any fatalities or not. Not sure. You know, those are approximate uh, numbers that we have at this stage. Um, so, you know, that uh, those figures will also become clearer um, as uh, we proceed over the next uh, few hours. Okay. Anybody in the hospital? Look, I'm not. Uh, I'm not sure. Um, we do, I know, do know that all of those emergency personnel are here. And earlier this afternoon, I did see um, uh, someone being carried on on a stretcher. Um, so you know, to the triage area, and uh, after that, they no doubt would be moved off to hospitals as required. Okay. As far as you know, at this stage, nobody has been killed. I'm um, not able to uh, to give any information there. I do not believe uh, that as such that anybody has been found to have been killed as yet. Okay. Now, it's going to be an overnight operation. Are you expecting support to come from elsewhere? I mean, George is a lovely town of South Africa, but it's pretty small. I wonder if you've got enough resources there with the emergency people. I saw a report earlier that the NGO gift of the givers and some emergency workers are on site. Are you going to need more resources? Yes, look, certainly they, they are assisting, you know, from a point of view of, of uh, providing cold drinks and energy drinks and... You know, that uh, type of refreshment for, for the workers doing here, we would welcome any assistance that uh, the public could uh, donate. As um, we are talking, uh, I can see bottles of water and so forth being carried past me. So, um, yes, that is taking place. And then emergency equipment and, and other skilled um, rescue personnel are on their way from, from Worcester and also from Cape Town to come and assist.